Hi folks, we're going to go through the 32RZR14 XLR Boost. Very nice fifth wheel. Got some ground lights effects. Got blue on the awning. The awning is electric. It does have... You can pull it down and tighten the little levers. Take it in here. The rain runoff. Don't let the wind get a hold of it. It's not a weather guard, it's a sunshade. You get a power cord, sewer line, table. You got a battery disconnect in here, so if you're not using it, kill it. Otherwise, the batteries will run down on brain boards, LP detector. You got the vents above the door and on the other side. Two full tanks of LP, do one at a time. You'll have one on the, if you run out, give you time to fill. Got your battery compartment, couple storages. Got your up and down, your front docking lights, which are very nice. All blue. Another LP, outside shower, you'll have hot and cold, we call it dog wash. Got magnets to hold the doors up, very nice. Motion lights inside. Nice feature. You got your city water connection and your fresh water. You got cable and satellite and a black tank flush. Just make sure you have the black on the left pulled before you hook your hose up to flush it. And it does say caution on that. Water heater is gas and electric. You want to install your anode rod, which will deteriorate in time, and you have a gas and electric reset button. Make sure you have water in it. Release that air. You see water, make sure they're pushed in, and you have electrical switch on the bottom, bottom left. You can go inside, and you'll have an LP switch for that also. You can run them both, and it'll give you endless hot water. basically recovers faster. Exhaust, I'd probably get a couple screens for that, but the only thing you need them for. Stove top vent, two thumb tabs underneath, open that up for more ventilation, baking, fish, things like that. It is generator capability. You do have a pump station in this for your units. There's the other vent, you can open from the inside. The ladder, you will take two pins out, pull the ladder, and check your roof. Do it regularly. You say every 90 days in the book, I would say almost every trip. The nice lighting on the outside, very nice. Big doors. Stabilizer. All you're going to do is kind of eyeball the front end level, put them down. It's on a relay switch, so if it stops, I don't need the motor stop to just relay, give it a minute or restart. Outside speakers, this is actually for the TV, cable and power outside. Very nice. The hard steps do have an adjustment. The pin here, just make sure it's very flat. Up top, do your door slowly. If you feel it bind, open it back up, put your legs down. Always double check that before you start slamming the door. You got your breaker box fuse box. If you see a red light in this window, it'll be the fuse that's blowing. Got an LPCO detector down there. Body sprays off, we'll set that off. In here, this will tell you your battery level. That'll be full. Black tank, gray tank. There's your water heater LP, the water pump if you're using the fresh water tank. Got your ground lights, awning lights, living room ramp lights. Extend retract for front awning and your slide. Thermostat, you're just going to scroll through. You're going to find your fan low, fan high, cool high, cool low, cool auto low. Cool auto high, I'd run that more on the autos. And then you have your heat. Temperature you can change or it'll always tell you what the inside temp is. 
It is solar capable. It has the units up top. If it's the wiring's in here, there's the vents. Pop the rubber bands off and use that as needed. Radio is Bluetooth. And the craziest thing about it is he drives a nice car. Look into that. Your lift system buttons here. You do have a charging system outlets. When you do on your ramp up and down, you do have the option of dropping the beds for more headroom. And if you want to leave the bed up top, follow the directions here. But you run this down, you can have your pins. You pin that up, and that'll leave the bed up. Take it back up, pull them down, and the bed will come with it. And stop at its desired spot. Got the cables, ramp, gate system. Lighting inside is just push button in the center. Light switch over here. Actually, you can manually do that too. DC fridge, very nice. Has a controller inside, good for travel. Very big, very nice. Stove top. You got a light switch there and a light switch for the oven. You turn your gas on and you have the igniter switch, which will also work for the oven. You have to hold the button in. I personally use the mirror of the glass to see it light up. I'm going to reach it in. Got your fan, light switch, microwave, nice shelving area, very nice sink setup. Remotes, manuals, all in the door. Very, very nice. Go through. Bathroom is nice, big. Closet space. GFI, you have to have your GFIs in for the outlets to work on the outside. Always strap your door. For travel and you have the fantastic fan, just open it up. Your desired speed. Very nice. Got your slide in and out up here. And for your air conditioner only is up top. Cable satellite for TV. Spacious room, nice closet dresser built in. It's like some storage underneath. Very nice. Nice. I hope this helps you. Go through your unit. If not, YouTube is a good source. You could always call us at All Seasons RV. Thank you for shopping. Have a great day.